a location that on camera, I always look for locations that also make black skin look great, but also told the story. We needed some place that had been there for, for years. Stop playing. Is this Blaze house? Where is Wesley? I want to talk to Wesley. If it is, you know what they paid for. Wait, hold up. I know I left this door open. Uh-uh, I'm gonna go get my sage. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, man. You good? Both in the locations that we picked, the way that we applied like the, the budget, the way that we applied like the design was one of like trying to keep things minimal but adding a lot of texture. Nice, I bet you just saw repurposed wood too. We were lucky enough to find in Brentwood of all places, this old house that had been there probably a hundred years. So the wood, was, I mean, this, this place was going nowhere. It was, it was, there were times we, you might hit the wood and and you could tell how solid this place was. So we wanted the, this house that they were gonna be locked into to have a character of itself and have a character that looked spooky at times, but also in the daylight might look inviting. Oh! Oh my gosh, this is so cute! And uh, we were able to find that. Uh, and we, we even checked both places, what I mean by both places. There was a plan at one point to even go um, to Atlanta possibly to shoot this and if we could find something in Los Angeles. And we found, we found this magnificent um, uh, uh, cabin in the woods, as you might say, um, in the middle of Brentwood, and, and thank God we did.